Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install IBM DB2 on Windows Server. I am on Windows Server. Now first we have to download the IBM DB2 database. In Google, search for download IBM DB2. Click on this DB2 database pricing. I will keep this download link in the video description. No need to worry. See, here we have Community Edition, Standard Edition and Advanced Edition. Click on this Download Free Edition. Now we have to sign up. Provide Mail ID. And other information like Username, first name, last name, and password. And we have to verify. Okay. I have already logged in. Just if I give them my Gmail or email ID, then this page will be redirected. See, it is going to redirect to already existing login. So I have to click on login. In your case, we you have to fill this data. Once you fill the, this data, then you have to click on start your version. So then you will receive seven digit code to your mail. Then you have to paste here. Click on continue. It's optional. You can check either yes or no. Select by email, then click on continue. See, these are the, in this video we are going to install DB2 database on Microsoft Windows. Click on this download. In another video, I will show you how to install on Linux. See, download has been started. In meantime, I am going to download WinRAR. We have to unzip WinRAR. We have to unzip this one also. If you want to install WinRAR, download and install it. See here, download has been completed. Go to downloads, first install WinRAR. Because this is zip file. Now right click on this V. It is a version of IBM DB2 database. Right click and select extract to this one. So it will extract the files and folders to the current directory. See, it has created a directory. After extraction completed, then go to this directory or folder, then go to this folder, then double click on the setup. Check this release information and pre-installation planning, upgrade information if you have already an existing DB2. Now click on this install a product. Scroll down, see here we have different installation install new buttons. Just click on this first one that is install new. See db2 community edition, then install new. Click on next, go through the license terms, then select I accept both IBM and non-IBM terms, then click on next. 
select the typical it is going to install these features close this one then click on next it is going to install on it is going to save settings in this response file click on next this is the installation folder if you want to change click on this change provide the directory path I am going with the default one I am not changing then click on next see this is the we don't have domain so it hasn't picked see this is the username you have to remember this username that is db2 admin provide the password for this db2 admin we have provided password for this db2 admin username notice here use the same account for remaining database db2 services then click on next this is the db2 instance name then click on next and select this setup your db2 server to send notification then click on next at present i am not going to enable this operating system security also and select it and click on next see this is the installation summary we can get the all details from this file then click on finish once we once we click on finish installation will be started See setup is complete. Then click on next. If you want to install database add-ins for the Visual Studio, click on install. This can be installed later also by clicking on the setup. Click on finish. If you want to create sample database, just click on this create sample database. So default drive is C. If you want to change, you can change. Then click on OK. This may take time. In next video, I will show you how to download and install IBM Data Studio client. Sample database has been created successfully. Close this one. Then click on OK. Close this first steps. By mistake, if you close this one, you can also get from the start. Then IBM DB2. See, here we have DBT first steps. You will get the same screen or same window. Okay, close this one. Now we are going to connect to IBM DB2. From your start menu, then click on this IBM DB2, copy one. Then see here, click on this DB2 command window administrator. Then simply give the DB2. We have successfully connected to DB2. Now verify list of the DB2 databases. List database, then directory. See, at present I have only one database. If you want to create another database, just create database like in other RDBMS. Give the same command then give the database name r2 admin no need to give semicolon and just press enter this may take time see the notification here 
create the create database command completed successfully now verify list database directory see now we have two entries one first one is c number of entries in the directory is two one first database name is r2 admin this is the alias name and this is the database name this is a sample which we have created by using the db2 first steps console okay so in this video we have seen how to download and install ibm db2 database on windows server in the next video we will see how to install ibm data studio that is the graphical user interface tool to connect to ibm db2 for more for more db2 videos please subscribe my channel thank you